Happy Families is wobbling soon to Children's BBC. Ed, we've done the wobbling the camera joke. Please! I must just tell you, by the way, that part two of that amazing Fantastic Max story continues tomorrow at 20 past four. And speaking of amazing, it's Heartbeat. Chap, I think he's been out in the cold for too mm. long. He's not looking very happy. He doesn't look he? very healthy. No. Why don't you put it in the warm oh, for a while a and idea. see if it comes round? I'll do that. Hello, Hi, Tony. Hello. Taking up gardening. Well, we're feeling a bit sorry for him. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think he needs a bit of warmth. What do you think? <laughs> this bit certainly oh, does. Dear, look at that. Well, the warmth might help. Yeah. Anyway, jolly good luck with it. Hello. Here we are, the three of us, back with another heartbeat. And today, it's all about flora. Now, not your auntie flora, but flowers and plants and things like that. One plant coming up. Paint. The sort of you, you use in school, you know all the, about this. On a sheet of glass and another one going over the top. That's the bit I like. Now, you don't have to use glass, of course. If you want to, use something like this, a bit of plastic sheet. Now, that's very good. As long as it's smooth like that, it'll work very, very well. The only thing is you can't see through it, as you can here. So it's rather fun to see exactly what's happening here. And when I've got that right, I prise the sheets of glass apart. There. Like that. Light-coloured sheet of paper going on there. Very, very little pressure needed. Otherwise, you'll spoil it. And there, we have something that looks rather like a fern. We can go on. We can use dark colored paper to pick up the paint. See what happens here. Again, just the lightest of pressure, and we'll peel it off. Oh, I think that's rather nice. There we are. Two delightful pieces of flora. all about flora today and one very interesting use of flower heads and foliage is in Jersey, the Channel Islands, where each year the Battle of the Flowers takes place. This wonderful pirate's head is all made out of flower petals. It's driving along on a big float here. It's a real carnival atmosphere about it and people work very hard building these boats. Look at this fierce looking dragon. It's absolutely brilliant. Weeks and weeks of effort goes into it. All the flowers are used in the colours that the people want to make the images. Here we have, dragging along this lovely castle, grand with flowers and white and purples and splendid yellows and all sorts of things. This morning as I was coming to the studio, I thought it'd be really nice to collect some bits and pieces. As they have done in the Battle of the Flowers, I thought I'd make an image as well, using these things. I've got some really nice dried bits of leaves and things like that. And in here I've got some exciting things which are really, really prickly. Ow! These are like animals in their own right. These are sweet chestnuts. So I'll, I'll, I'll dig all of these out. Just out of my basket. 
doesn't take long. And they're not, um, there's so many lovely things to pick up from that have fallen off trees and lying on the ground. You'll recognise these ones. These are chestnuts. Oh, yes. Lovely. And here, some nice big bag of dried leaves and bits. Let's keep these here. Now, I think I'll put these. I want these over here. Just like that. I think that's right, just there. I'll move my prickly ball right up into the centre like that, I think. No, what have we got in here? Some leaves. Pull these leaves out. Yes. And I want these as a nice base, a nice firm ground. Got some bits of stick, even a feather in the middle of it. I'll put those down here. There. What have we got left? Oh, this little creature. He's very shy, you know. Do you know what he's called? There's a special new name for him. It's a hoglet, which is a baby hedgehog. And he's in a ball because hedgehogs, baby hedgehogs especially, get very frightened. Oh, come on, baby hedgehog, come out. I know. I've got some petals left over. Let's see if he'll come out and say hello. I'll put these down here, just like this. That curl of a snout, because he's got a little curly snout hedgehog. Here we are, nice shiny conker for the nose, little eye. We have an autumn collaged hedgehog. Mm.